Well, I'm our Frank Samars. You better hold on to your cell phones because, uh, California's going after your cars and now they're going after your cell phones. California health officials release guidelines to avoid cell phone radiation. You can go to hell! The first time ever, the California Department of Public Health has released guidelines about harmful cell phone radiation and how you can avoid it. You have to be patient with the site because it's jumping all around. Dr. Karen Smith with the California Department of Public Health said, We recognize there are a lot of people in the general public who have some concerns about their cell phones and whether using a cell phone is safe. I'm not one of them. Smith said, When you sleep, you keep your cell phone at least an arm's length away from your body, and also not carrying your cell phone in your pocket, having it in your, either your purse or not carrying it with you. Get out of your minds. How am I supposed to carry it? I don't have a purse. You're out of your minds. I'm glad I don't live in California. The problem is that this will come here next, I'm sure. Because Governor Cuomo will see it and say, Oh, gee, isn't that nice? Let's start regulating and taxing their uh, cell phones to make them safer. Research suggests cell phones could increase our risk for brain cancer and tumors, low sperm count, headaches, as well as impaired memory, hearing, and sleep. That is bullshit. That's BS. That is bullshit. Bullshit. Dr. Joel Moskowitz at UC Berkeley said, Currently, we're not doing a good job in regulating radi radiation from these devices. In fact, we're doing an abysmal job. Uh, when they get done with it, if they start regulating it, the thing's not going to work. Moskowitz says this is a long time coming. Yeah, they uh, haven't figured out how to tax them yet, but any more than they already have. He's partially responsible for bringing this information to light. He sued the Department of Health, Public Health for refusing to release information about the dangers of cell phone radiation back in 2009. So this is an enemy of freedom. He's an enemy of this country. He comes from Berkeley, what can you expect? The spring he won the case. People are being injured and harmed by the delay in having this information accessible to them. That's the one side. So this release means the state police cell phones are dangerous. It comes a double speak part. Not at all, said Dr. Karen Smith. Our position is that science is evolving. You are a liar. Liar, liar, pants on fire. Unbelievable. They said one of the main reasons they decided to release these guidelines now is that there are new numbers out showing that cell phone use is higher than ever, with 95% of Americans using them on a regular basis. So they're going to make it more expensive for you to have one of those things. Uh, now, they're lining up the tax on this one and all. They already have tax after tax after tax on them, but... You, you can bet there'll be a cell phone tax in your future if you don't shut these people down. Now you're going to say something. Uh, keep thing at arm's length. Oh, gee. Look around your workplace. Everybody there is using these things on a daily basis. As for not carrying them in my pocket, how the hell am I supposed to carry it? I don't have a purse. People are out of your minds. And I do keep data shut off, but that's for a different reason. Yeah, the thing was screwing up when I was it that way. But anyway, there you have it. They're lining up to go after your cell phones next. 
unfucking believable. Sorry for the language, but I am pissed, boy. I am pissed. <laughs> this is something that I use. I don't use it much. I only use it for the phone and for a timer and a couple of things, but... You're going after your phones, folks. Watch out. Tomorrow for next tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Ah. Uh...